For me, the hallmark of a really great, exciting scientific question is one that its answer doesn't just uh, unlock some profound mystery. It's that it also immediately poses a lot of other great questions. The act of asking one question and seeking an answer to it only causes more great questions to multiply. And the world just gets more and more interesting with, with, with every, every turn of, of the crank on that. When I'm standing shoulder to shoulder with so many other people on the subway, and there's something we all start to understand about what exactly is too close to stand comfortably to someone else. We will sort of distribute ourselves at a, at, a, at a best comfortable distance given the number of people who are there. I think there are sort of these kinds of questions that, that, that just pop to mind all the time. Um, everywhere you look, there are sort of mysteries of our behaviors and the things around us. Science is really in the question asking and answer seeking business. We'll almost always yield something interesting, fascinating, valuable. Typically that's something that will then trigger us to ask a lot of other questions, um, but we're always better off for, for seeking those, those answers.